Hey guys, this is Eamon from the Tech Info Team. Visit us on the web at techinfoteam.com. And I've got a video here on the tethering capabilities of Android Froyo running on the Nexus One. Now, uh, tethering previously was only available for rooted devices, uh, and even then, it was not entirely stable. Um, my experience with uh, wireless tethering on rooted devices has not been great. I've gotten it to connect, but internet connection was very spotty, and I wasn't. It wasn't to the point where I felt like I could use it regularly. Now, what I do want to show you here is how tethering will work on Froyo. And right here, I just go into Wireless and Networks, and Tethering and Portable Hotspot. And as the device is plugged into my computer as well by USB, I've got USB tethering and portable Wi-Fi hotspot. Now tapping portable Wi-Fi hotspot takes about maybe five to ten seconds before the hotspot is enabled and once that happens it tells me my hotspot is active and it brings up a little notification there saying that it's active. I can touch it to configure. I've already gone ahead and configured this uh, to Android AP for the SSID and I thought it was interesting here that you've only got two options for security you've got your open security which I guess you guys can't see because it's too bright for the camera to focus on or you've got WPA2 there's nothing in between you don't have WEP uh, or WPA1 now I'm fine with WPA2 some people may want less security I'm not sure why but there are people like that out there so we're gonna go ahead and cancel this I've already set up a password on the network and I've actually paired it with this iPhone before so let's see the hotspot is active I don't have a sim card in this iPhone so it has no internet connection the Wi-Fi turn on and right there Android AP there it goes it's connected and I'm using 3G on T-Mobile for this phone for the Nexus one so let's go ahead and load up a page let's try we've already got techcast.net loaded up there let's try something else let's try Gizmodo Not use this iPhone keyboard. Gizmodo.com. And remember, this is running off the 3G connection from the Nexus One. So it's not the fastest thing in the world. It's not as fast as maybe my home network for Wi Fi. But if you watch right there, we're loading up Gizmodo.com, the main page. Fully functional. Minus flash content, of course. Might have to just use the Nexus One for that. And just like that, running off of T Mobile's 3G network, we've loaded up Gizmodo.com. So, if you guys have any other questions, uh, that is Wi Fi tethering on the Nexus One running Android Froyo 2.2 uh, and connected to an iPhone 3GS, providing the internet connection. So thanks for watching, and check me out on Twitter, uh, twitter.com slash Eamon Farouk if you have any other questions, uh, or leave a comment on this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks.